are facing off in Houston tonight in a debate that you can see right here at 8 p.m. on uh, ABC, mm. 8 p.m. Eastern, sorry. Many are expecting a face-off between the frontrunners Joe Biden and Senator Elizabeth Warren. What do you think is going to go down tonight? <laughs> Who knows? <laughs> on Thursday, Thursday, Thursday. <laughs> it's getting a little boring to me. I would like to see Elizabeth Warren put Bernie in a headlock. I really would yeah, I do. That. Something like that. Go, go for it. And what's his name? Yang? Is that it? Uh, yeah. Yang. 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 He, he, uh, he's got a surprise. What is it? What is the surprise? Well, last time he wore no tie. He was the first president oh, to never not wear a tie on the stage. <laughs> I think tonight might, might be a little more aggressive in whatever he's doing. He said he but... was going to wear a gold chain on Twitter last night. Oh. I said, I support that. I like the gold <laughs> chain. What is the reason for that? What's it's a that? joke. He's a joke. I appreciate his sense of levity in all of this. Yes. But I, I actually do hope he has a moment tonight because I think mm -hmm. there are a lot of Andrew Yang fans out there. And this is what I love about a democracy is you've got so many different people on a stage in the yeah. same political party. Bernie, uh, Sanders, and when Warren are really fighting for the same voters and they're neck and neck in the polls. So I would rather mm -hmm. see, I'm, I agree with you, I'd rather see them go at it. Yeah. Kamala I think it's Harris too early. I think yeah. everybody should just stop trying to discount and figure out what's going on. You'll know when you know. But yeah. you, you, know? you also like, if you don't mind me saying, you also like Andrew Yang. You have a, like, yes, some of but you have said. not heard me say I want him to be president. No, I have not. No, no you have. That is the difference. So for me, I always feel it's important to listen. And that's how, you know, because I would not have paid attention. But what he said resonated with me. And here's my wish. I wish the party would say, you know what, here are five great ideas from five different candidates. This is how we think we can help America win again. That's what I want. I don't want to hear you coming down on this one. He's too old. He's too white. Right. She's too big. He's too fat. I want to hear any of that. <laughs> I want you to tell me how you're going to return me to having a little money in my pocket for working 9,000 hours a day. Right. I want you to tell me how you're going to help my family move, even if it's just this way. How are you going to help me move forward? Because all this other stuff is a lot of <laughs> to me. It's like, yeah. you know, I don't hear it. What do you want to do for me as an American? That's what I want. There is a lot of echo chain. Yeah, that's yeah. what I want. I think that's what most Americans want. Actually. I think so, too. So I got to go. And we'll be back with more Hot Topics.